me a stream and today is the third day I'm at Kurai Lake hoping to catch a trophy Kurai char. Uh, before we start fishing, uh, I don't care about the time of the day anymore. Uh, before it used to be as soon as it's morning that's when I uh, used to start fishing. Because nighttime you don't really get much. Uh, but uh, not this time. Uh, it doesn't matter. At nighttime, you catch fish as well. So let me just quickly see at the cafe. Uh, there's two interesting orders here. The grailing seems to be a doable one, but you got to use uh, the the keelas for it or the spiker. Uh, so I'm not going to use that. Uh, but Sivan and Pike, look at these. Both are actually this is a much bigger trophy size. Because I was wondering, I think 12 kg is a trophy pike. But how is the pike worth less than the Sivan trout? But at 8 kg, someone trot is a trophy, so uh, they got a bigger amount. I'm gonna go ahead and start the journey. Oop. Uh, trolling mode is J. Well, I haven't, uh, I haven't trolled for some time, so I don't, <laughs> I don't, I don't remember how to. What button to press for trolling? Okay. Once again, our regular technique, 10 meter hole, uh, go over to the 15, touch the 15, come over here. Maybe we can go 3 to 12 as well. Uh, only time will tell for now. Uh, it is night time, so it's going to be a little bit hard. Watch the stream. Uh, but it's okay. Uh, we have beautiful weather coming up as well. Look at that. 12 degrees. Funny. So I think we are going to have awesome fishing. I really hope so. Unlike last weekend when uh, it was cloudy. So uh, it is night time. It will be a little bit slow, but it's fine by morning. You know, we can wait it out a little bit. Hopefully, there'll be more viewers joining in, and uh, we can get this party started. So once again, a recap of the trophies I have at Kurai. We have Arctic Char, Lake Trout, Sivan Trout, Wendace, all trophies. Look at that Sivan Trout. That's the biggest trophy I've ever caught in terms of how rare the fish is and how much it was worth. 330 silver. Right now, Kurai Char is the last remaining fish for me. And we have, I believe, a better setup as well. Crap, not again. Ah, real listen. That was my mistake. Okay. Recast it. So usually you press G to show your uh, setup information. Uh, but in this case, I have to press uh, the V key. And uh, so we have 28.5 kg lines and 20. 8.2 kg uh, liters, floral liters, and 30 kg rods for all three setups. So we should do a much better job at catching. Catching larger fish it shouldn't take us too much longer. Uh, we can go ahead for the 12 meter hole right now. Let's see how it goes. There's fish on this one. It might be a tiny little fish. Oh, and it's off. We had a fish, but it got off. That's fine. 
So I do have a two hour rental, so let's see how much we can get in the two hours. Okay, I need to straighten out a little bit once we get to the right spot here. Uh, I think a little bit like this. Oh yeah, we are set. Uh, no fish so far, that's fine. It is night time, to be expected. There really isn't any bottom feeding spots at Kura right now. Uh, there used to be bream spot uh, over here by the 15 meter hole you would di uh, throw in from the sandbar. But I don't know if that's still active. And there's just no point to it, it's just way too... Uh, way too annoying to set up oh wow uh jim Leahy, someone trust 7.8 kg uh 0.2 kg off of a trophy 7.8 kg so you need 8 kg to uh, get a trophy oh that sucks but you know what? it's a it's a really nice cast nonetheless Let's see if we can't get a C1 Trout today. <laughs> uh, but really, our main goal is uh, the Kurachar. Uh, people are ca getting good fish today, so I have a good feeling we should catch something. Something <laughs> something of a big size. I'm just gonna wait till morning before I announce in-game as well that I'm streaming. <laughs> a lot of people aren't on today. From our chat. Uh, who are usually, so. Okay. Okay, so I'm hearing good reports by people. Uh, they're getting good fish. With the hunters, that's the one we have right now. Uh, what am I? I have 60 centimeter fluorocarbon liters. Uh, I think uh, that should be good. And then uh, once we get to this deep part, we will go over the 10 meter and we will come on this side and turn around. Uh, uh, not a lot of people are on right now. <laughs> Just... Okay. Alrighty, everything should be good. Uh, west? West of docks. Yeah. Yeah, I think uh, this is where he's been fishing. And he's been getting them. I think that's where I got my 14kg Urai as well. Let's see if we can uh, go over there and get something big. Wow, nothing so far though. Getting me worried. Let's see if we can <laughs> get something good. 
Because, uh... Wow, nothing yet. Holy cow. I'm worried if it's my braided line, but we do have fluorocarbon leaders. Uh, let's just turn around and go towards. Oh, there we go. We got something. Okay, okay. Ooh, a lake trout. Nice. Let me throw it over there. Let's see how it goes. Alright, I'm gonna turn around because I think the 10 meter hole is my favorite place. And we will just go towards there. Hopefully it should pick up, maybe at 5 a.m. Morning time. That's when it's active. Uh, we are going to hit the 10 meter hole soon. That should hopefully get us something here. And we have something on our second line, second rod over there. Oh, nothing. Wow. Hi, Jessica. It's so good to see you. I was getting worried. Hey, Jess, Jess is not here. <laughs> the stream is incomplete without you. Uh, so, Jess, today's my third day. Third attempt at Kura. I'm hearing very positive things by people. They're getting big fish. Jim Lee, he just caught an amazing Kura char. And if you look at the weather, it's sunny and it's cool. Uh, so I have high hopes for this. For today. Uh, so far, I've just got one fish though. Which is a little concerning. But it is morning, early morning. So let's see if we can't get something big. Uh, Hunter1001 is working for them. <laughs> uh, yes, yes. Uh, Hunter1001 is working. Uh, so. And I have a Hunter green one. 1006. I will switch that out if it stays too dry for a while. I have better setup this time around too. Uh, how's your weekend going so far, Jess? Congratulations on hitting a level 38. Oh, Tunguska. That's great. <laughs> having, having luck. We should all get a break once in a while, right? <laughs> Today, hopefully, I'll get a break at Kurai. You had a nice bit of fishing, I guess, at Tunguska. That's great. Uh, I don't know what the heck is going on here. <laughs> Not, nothing so far. Hopefully that's not a sign. Uh, again, my second rod. I don't know if there's a fish on it. I'm just going to go ahead and check it out. Yeah, there's nothing on this. So I just bought a 30 kg rod on my third setup for my third setup so I don't have any weak links anymore. Uh, so far so good with the weekend and we have a fish. Uh, I just haven't played Russian fishing for ever since my last stream. I have been busy trying to record other series. Uh, I just got busy as well with life. Uh, today is actually my first day. I don't know when was this last stream? Wednesday? Since then I just I was so busy yesterday as well trying to set up different things. Uh, so yeah, it's good to be back. Uh, I'm very happy the weather is going to be good today. Everything is cooperating, so I have good high hopes today. How about you, Jess? Good thing Tunguska is giving back. So I'm sure it's a good weekend for you as well, I hope. 
Let's start to the weekend. It's Saturday. Yes, it's summer. Oh, yeah. <laughs> How can you not <laughs> be having a good day? Ooh, our second round finally has something here. Uh, so hopefully it picks up well for us. Oh, man, that's a small guy here. Perch, isn't that the same size perch you just caught? <laughs> No, you got a much bigger perch. I'm going to go towards the boating dock. Because uh, Jim was having a good luck over there. Yep. Hello everyone, thank you for joining in. Uh, today is a beautiful day at Kurai. Uh, it's really doing well for people, so let's see if we can't get something big here. Now I'm using power braids and 60 centimeter fluorocarbon liters. I don't know why when I was setting up, I was like, why don't I have 300 meter uh, long fluorocarbon lines? And then I realized you just need it for your liters. I was getting worried maybe our, uh, the braided lines were scaring off fish. I guess Jim logged off. Hey Clem, how's it going? Ooh, arc charge, yes. 2.4 kg. Uh, let's see how it goes today. Okay, another tiny fish here. Arctic char. So good to see everyone tune in. I really appreciate it. Is there fish on this guy? No. I'm just trying these shallow ends today. Uh, so because Jim was fishing there, Jim Leahy, and uh, he was getting good, good fishing. So yes. What the heck is this? What? Oh, is this for XP boost? Uh, Clem, you're at Amber. Oh, that sucks. I hope it picks up for you. Uh, I don't know if you have Tunguskan luck, but Jess is having luck there. Uh, I guess it just depends on the weather and... From Dengaska. Yeah, thank you so much, S. Holy cow, why is Kura so quiet? It's the perfect weather. Uh, so I have size 3 hooks. These are your standard hooks. I haven't changed it to size 1 or anything. Okay, let me change the lure on this. Uh, let me change it to Hunter 10. 
Oh, there's something on our first rod. Okay. That's another lake trout here. Okay, let's try this new lure here. Okay, thanks, yeah. Did I drink it now? I feel like once the fish start to bite and I'm catching a lot of fish, then that's the time. Or maybe if I have a big fish on, I have to remember to just, uh, just chug it down then. Oh, once again, our first rod has something on it. That's great. with this guy is. That's another arctic. Wow. On marker still. Uh, Sammy, what spot are you on at Amber? Three hundred silver per hour, Christy. Oh, at Wolk. Yeah, Volkov is. Uh, I've always made three hundred silver or more per hour there. I feel that's the most balanced lake or map there is so far. Even when it feels slow, I still ended up making three to three hundred what thirty silver in the one hour I spent there uh, a week or two ago. And that's where I want to go next. I just need this darn Kurai char though. Uh, I don't know why guys, but it's very slow. Oh crap, not again. Well, I have a fish on at least. It is a lake trout, uh, 1.7 kg. Okay, that's great. I guess it gave me the chance to sink my lures in. Okay, uh, Sammy, if you're still here, yes, just mention in the uh, in the stream chat of a working spot, possibly, possibly. I think Sammy might have left the stream. <laughs> Dream and night. Ah. And we have a fish on another one. Okay, we are getting fish now, but uh, it's still. This is what I have so far. Uh, <laughs> it's not much. Uh, I'm hoping it'll start up soon. And that is a tiny fish. Better end ace. Yes. See if we can't get something from the 10 a meter hole. Uh, besides that, maybe their spots have changed. I'm not sure. I'm trying the shallow ends too. It was working for someone. Uh, uh. 
Okay, I will try the shallow end. Oh well, Jim Leahy had Hunter 1001 and he got good fish at the shallow end. Wobblers, you say? Uh, white and red dodgers. Uh oh. White and red dodgers. What the heck is a dodger? Uh, I don't have dodgers. And for the wobblers, I'm gonna have to change. Oh, we have something. Oh, we have something on both of them. Okay, so maybe the shallow end does work. Uh, Lake Trout, another one. Nice. Oh, Sevan Trout, 2 kg. Okay, that's our first nice fish. Yeah, it's very odd though. Someone's having really good luck with the uh, blue hunters and then for others it's just not working. Uh, let me just go to the weekly and see what's going on here. I think it's still gonna be the blue. Uh, what am I looking for? Urai Char. Uh, it's still the hunter. Ooh, what the heck is this? Icon Fat M. Okay, so the Hunter 1009, I have the Hunter 1002, so we can go ahead and try that. Uh, Lake Trout, Hunter 1002, Hunter 1001, uh, Sevan Trout is... Uh, oh wow, Aquila. We have a huge variety of stuff now. Uh, so, oh wow, I got fish on all three. Another small Sivan Trout. What fish is this? Lake Trout. That 10 meter hole though is amazing. Another Lake Trout. Lots of Lake Trouts today. When I start getting big fish, I will take that uh, Tunguska gift <laughs> special. Yeah. Uh, oh, 15, 10. 12, 15, and 10. Okay. Got something small here. Ooh, a perch. A fat perch. Dart. Flip 45. Wow. That's a far cast. Oh Jess, I'm so sorry. I was trying to see if I can stream uh, Nomad Sky, but it's such a hassle just recording the game. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to make a video series on it. Uh, the game... Oh, there we go. Okay, I am not going to... Lock my break up. But let's see what this is. This is the exact same spot we got that Sivan Trout. Trophy Sivan Trout. Oh wow, someone's saying Volk is dead as well. Wow. 
How can Wolf be dead? Uh. <laughs> Thank you, Jess. I. Yeah, I was finally able to record videos on that game. Uh, it's just that it's on another engine. So the software I use, OBS, it does not record it, which means I cannot even stream it. And I have an NVIDIA video card. Uh, and it has, ooh, nice Tamen 7.8. I really don't know how big Tamens are usually. That might be a baby worthless non-marker, but seems like a nice size. A <laughs> Dilly Tamen. <laughs> yeah, no one likes him. They're too powerful, I guess. Uh, but basically, I have an NVIDIA video card and it comes with its own recording software. So I was like, okay, maybe I can... Uh, maybe I can stream with that because it gives me the option. But for some reason, I cannot log in. It just gives me an error. I don't understand why. Unfortunately, that's off the table. Okay, we look. it looks like we have a nice sized uh, Arctic char here. Maybe 8 kg? I hope. Come on. Holy cow, 9.45 kg. Finally. 10,000 XP. Okay. Very happy with that. Uh, do I have anything on my other rod? No, I do not. Phew. That's something at least. <laughs> All right, you know what? It might be hope for us after all. <laughs> uh, 15 meter hole. Uh, so far it is looking like this. Finally a few marker fish. Thank you. Let's just go through that 15 meter. If we can. Ooh, there's another fish on it. It's a small one, but that's fine. Oh, that's a Wendace, isn't it? A finally marker. Yep, we are right on that 15 meter hole. Oh my god, another one. These Wendy's are abundance. In abundance at that hole. Oh no, that's a perch. 236. Wow, 26 AG Mare Dutch Feast. Nice work. We have something on our second one. That'd be another Wendy's. Looks like it. Oh no, that's a lake trout. Wow, that is a very small lake trout. Where are we off by 9.4? What Arctic Char? I think 10 kg is a trophy or 11. Uh, I'm not sure. Let me check. Yeah, Arctic 11 is a trophy. I believe. No, 10. Never mind. I, I don't know, but it's okay. We were close. Let's go through the shallow end here. And then we'll hit the 10 meter, 10 meter hole. Uh, yeah, unfortunately, you know what? Bear was doing so well for me the two days I fished there. On the third day, I was like, you know what? I feel confident this is a true and tested spot, so let me stream here. And that day, I just don't know what happened. <laughs> the fish were like, nope. <laughs> two days are enough fishing for you. And we have another lake trout. Nice. 
picked up, so I'm happy. And wow, lots of lake trouts. Like, you know, Arctic char is like the most common thing here. Uh, but lots of lake trouts today. Uh, like, look at how many lake trouts we have. And Arctic char, we have only four. Wow. It is 11.6 degrees and sunny. Oh no, I forgot to drink that thing. Keep forgetting. Uh, Sammy, did you find that spotted amber? Are you there yet? Hope it's working out for you. As soon as I get another fish, I'm just gonna drink that drink. Okay, there we go. Uh, I'm just gonna drink this. I just don't know when I'm gonna get, catch the next fish and I'm probably gonna forget to drink, so. Ooh, a pike. <gasps> Look at that, bonus. I haven't seen that since I was new to the game. So someone said if I make apple cider, uh, I can get extra bonus XP and that's something I really want because I think it's very easy to make and it's cheap to make in abundance Okay, well good luck Sammy we get something big uh, I was hoping today I could hit level 26 because I cannot wait to go to uh, uh, To go to amber And get some big carps I hope Okay, let's see this bonus, <laughs> 23 XP, how much bonus does it give, Ooh, wow, uh, what is the percentage, I don't know how many percent it gives, uh, possible, yeah, not say. I was actually thinking about streaming Horizon Dawn. Because that game just came out. Uh, ooh, nice pink salmon. Uh, Jess. That is a beautiful fish. I know it looks weird to you. I think you've said it before. <laughs> Oh, I can't wait to catch that. But I wanted to uh, stream that game as well, Horizon Dawn. When it came out in 2017 for the councils, it looked so good. Holy cow. And now that it's finally on PC, it's... I can't wait to play it. Uh, Jess, do you know how much percentage bonus this gives this Tunguska vodka oh whoops got that rod Arctic char Uh, Horizon Dawn just released yesterday. <laughs> so Horizon Dawn released yesterday and Fast and Furious, that video game released yesterday as well. Uh, apparently it's like one and a half hours of racing gameplay and two and a half hours of cutscenes. It's almost like watching the movie. <laughs> Uh, I wanted to try that game out too, but honestly, with recording all of these video series, I just, I don't have time for that. Metro? Yes, I've played Metro. That is a very cool game. 
Unfortunately, the last title was, I think, the best one, but I... Oh, wow, look at how... F but I just couldn't finish it. I don't know why. I just lost interest. But I absolutely love it when uh, you go up on the tower, and from a distance, you can see this thunderstorm, this huge thunderstorm roll in. And you're still at the top of the tower, and it starts raining, and there's lightning. It's absolutely amazing. That's my favorite part. Like, I love... In real life like severe weather i love thunderstorms lightning all that stuff even though sometimes it's scary but uh i love that stuff so when they do a good job of it in video games i absolutely enjoy it and that's basically where i stopped playing the game <laughs> uh it's okay jess uh it doesn't even say in the game how much percentage of a bonus uh this is but i can always ask on uh on Discord. Okay. I think I have fish on both of them. Oh ho ho ho! Did you see that? Oh, that fish was following! And I just saw it in the water and I stopped last second. Got that fish. Okay, well, we are getting XP. Thank you so much, Jess, for that. It's a huge bonus for me. I think what I want to do, if I remember, is once I end the stream, uh, just start making food. Because I really, really, really want... Uh, not ground bait making, uh, cooking. I really want apple cider, but I don't think even after two hours of continuous grinding, I'm going to get to the apple cider. It's way too high, 80%. I'm halfway there. Okay, let's stick to the shallow end here. Uh, sit rep on the fish. I've been here half hour now. Uh, we just have almost one line of markers. Our biggest is 9.4 kg Arctic chart. That's going to bring in good money. I don't know. 30 to 60 silver maybe? And then Sivan Trout's probably going to be like 10 or 15 silver. And Lake Trout's. Uh, the Arctic Chars is just not around today. It's all Lake Trout day today. Uh, not a single Kura Char though. I'm going to switch this lure up again. And I don't know which one to try. I'm going to try the Hunter 3 because I think on the weeklies the... Orange Hunter is on as well. Head towards... Uh, did someone just come here? Yeah. Do they have time to say hi in the chat? Because, uh... Not too crazy so far. <laughs> Let's see if this 10 meter hole can't give us something. I want to check the leaderboard again, but... One fishy. The one rod has a fish on it. Both rods have fish on it. Okay. And there you go. 10 meter hole. Every time. Oh. Never mind. I was fooled. Lake trout again. Okay. Let them sink in and then I'll start the boat because we are right above the 10 meter hole. Okay. I think that's good enough. Let me quickly set this out. Uh, a bear 55. Uh, 55. 63. I don't know, boilies or potatoes. Clip is 
Oh no, what's the clip? 21. Okay. I think that spot at bear should still be active. Yeah. I think my dreams... Yes, another maybe decent sized fish. My dream still is to go to bear and get something big. Because uh, ever since I was a new player, I think all new players... Uh, they've been scared off by people telling them bear has big fish and they're going to get spooled. So we have big expectations when we finally make it to bear. A decent sized 5kg lake trout. If there is an order for the lake trout, we can make uh, decent money actually. Uh, 67. Let me throw it all the way to the side there. Yeah, 22 meter clip, right? I'm gonna go over the 15 meter hole. I'm not gonna turn around. But I'm not seeing any Kurai chars in the chat. One person had a lot of luck here. Uh, a DJ, hello. So good to see you once again. I hope your weekend is going by great. Uh, holy cow, barbell trophy? Uh, what was that on? Was it on potatoes or boilies? Congrats on the barbell trophy. Hey, someone got a Kurai Char. Yes, good. Yeah, just this rod is... Ah. Uh, perch. Okay. Yeah, barbel, like I said, looks like corn. <laughs> Where is the barbel I've caught? What's the biggest barbel I've caught so far? Uh, 3.459 kg on diced potatoes. This looks like corn. Looks like a very rough fish if you feel it, if you hold it. Uh, on cheese, right? Okay, that's cool. Yeah, I think I got them on potatoes and cheese as well. I got my first trophy grass carp on potatoes on my first day at uh, Bear. That was amazing. <laughs> I don't think my second rod has a fish on it. It just likes to bend a lot. Uh, I ended up buying one more brand new rod, 30 kg from Kura. I didn't go bother going to Volkov. And uh, yeah, hey, we have fish on. And we have fish on the other second one too. It's a small perch. So we have two nice sized fish, one 9.4 kg and one 5 kg. Uh, wow, our first pike. Let's see if we can't get something big. Oh no, <laughs> someone's... I don't know, maybe uh, 12 degrees or cooler uh, might be the answer. Maybe this is just borderline between... Uh, maybe this is just borderline cold and warm, probably. Uh, you can find out my trophies, I'm a feeder Sammy. 
Uh, Sammy, can you post in the in-game chat? So I can just click on your name and, uh... Uh, under 10 degrees, it's better? Damn it. Uh, today was the day. Hike. Hike, okay. Oh, Peter Sam. Oh, fish got away. <laughs> no. Oh, wow. 1,000 hours. Damn. Wow, you got a golden tench? Diced cheese. Wow. Uh, let's see here. Bear Lake. There's the common barbel on diced cheese. 19,000 XP. That's amazing. And it looks different too. It's like it's more squarish, cylindrical. Okay. Uh, so I guess it makes sense if the fish are at shallows. Uh, because they're right under the trees where the shade is and it's uh, cooler there. Although, to me, when the water is really hot, fish go to the deep end. You know what, guys? Unfortunately, I guess it's too warm. Uh, if Volkov is active, heck, I'll just go there. Yeah, that's a really cool trophy, Sammy. 12 degrees and sunny. How is it at, like at Volkov? No, it's too warm at Volkov today. 17 degrees, that's no good. 14 degrees is fine, and then it's 16 and 17. It's not good weather at Volkov as well. Uh, why did they have to make the weather so bad on the weekends? Oh, you know what? That was a mistake. No fish on this. If it's warm at night time should be more active then. Because fish feed at night as then. Yeah. Uh, lake trap. You know what? That's why we're not catching any arctic chars. That's why we're only catching lake trouts today. Holy cow, look at all these lake trouts. Uh, but look at that, that's so weird. Arctic char, 9.4 kg is our biggest fish. The rest, it's just lake trouts. So they are fine with warm weather. It's just Arctic chars don't like warm weather. Uh, I guess it makes sense then. Wow. They went a little too hard on the fish, honestly. Jess is having so much. Jess is doing so much better. 4.8 kg Arctic char. Hey, we have a fish on. Can I get a visitor pass <laughs> to get to Tunguska? You know, like maybe they should just do two hours of in real life time visitor pass. And that's it. In a 24 hour period, I can just stay at Tung for two hours. And just get a taste of it. <laughs> That'd be cool. Wow, look at the bite rate all of a sudden. It's just non-marker after non-marker. Eyed. I'm always happy to see Eyed. Oh yeah, I wonder how long I have uh, the XP bonus for after drinking that. I have no idea. Uh... Nice, Ami. At least uh, it's somewhat realistic then, this game. If you're replicating real life and it actually worked, then that's great. Uh, all chars migrate to Tunguska. Yeah. Yes, give... <laughs> give us back some. At least some <laughs> of the chars. 
hide is a very nice welcome side fish. Uh, they're always markers, so I'm happy with that. But I just am not that hardcore of a fisherman in real life. Uh, so many of you guys are in-game. Holy cow. Uh, like, I live in Toronto, right? Like, I've lived by the Great Lakes almost my whole life. Majority of my life. And I had no idea there were big fish on our lake. I thought it was just, you know, dead lake. It was mm, small fish, probably. Uh, but recently I discovered this huge salmon in our lake. And uh, I last summer, I believe it was last spring, uh, I took a charter out uh, on Lake Ontario. And I got a huge salmon. And uh, my brother got a very nice sized salmon too. And these were different species salmon. Unfortunately, I don't remember the names. But I just don't want to take up a random name. Uh, so that was pretty cool. Uh, when we were kids, we used to go to uh, one of the lakes. And we used to rent a boat. And we used to just fish for bass. And uh, I believe sunfish or panfish. I think that's what we used to get as well. And uh, for many years now, like I go to Florida because I have family there. And we always, always went. When it's winter, we take a charter out. And we know like two guys, you know, they'll take us out for fishing. And it's just such amazing fishing there. It's insane. I got a 30 pound grouper uh, there as well. What a fight. <laughs> I enjoy that. That's the biggest fish I've caught so far. Uh, yes, what did you catch? What did you catch? I'll just check the chat in a second. I have two fish on right now. Uh, it's a small pike. Uh, another small pike. Gofi Arctic? No way! <laughs> Where is it? I want to see it in the chat. Holy cow! 11.435 kg. Congratulations. Oh man. It's not even a competition anymore. You already won. And this guy is OP. Needs to be nerfed. Jessica is OP. You need to be nerfed. <laughs> uh, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Uh, but congratulations. After those, you know, crappy little days, you finally, finally have good luck at Tunguska. Ooh. We have something on our second rod. It's a good thing we don't just do bottom fishing at nighttime because there's always a chance of getting a decent sized fish. Uh, no, that's a tiny fish. Tiny pike. 2.27. Not bad. We are getting fish at least, you know, I'm, I'm happy with that. We have 48 fish, holy cow. Uh, 48 fish. Uh, we've been here 47 minutes, so one fish a minute. Uh, but look at the quality though, it's just one row. Uh, so that's a little sad. Yeah. Now I want to see your profile. Once again. Uh, how do you check the profile? Why isn't it doing that? Let's see here. Let's put you on the spot. <laughs> Asp? No way. Is it that expensive of a fish? 11 kg. Wow. How much was that asp? Was it more than 330 silver? Uh, where is Tunguska? What? There is no Tunguska for you. Trophies. Arctic char, you got a 15 kg Arctic here? Holy cow. You are hardcore. Wow, 15 kg, that's... What is a blue trophy? I think that'll be 20 kg. Uh, we have... Went to shore. Oops. Let me quickly just get that fish. Oh, I think another fish was following us. 
Okay, 300 something, that's very close to, uh... That's very close to... The Sewan Trout. Wow, Sewan Trout's worth that much, eh? That's crazy. Uh, Pike Blue. Okay. Oh yeah, Asp is a fighter. I remember my uh, fishing for them on Wolk. I'm actually so excited to go to Volkov. I just cannot wait. Uh, but this <laughs> Kura is fighting back. Really? Okay, where are you, Jess? I need to look at your profile again. Uh, why in trophies is there no Tunguska? You just got a trophy, maybe? Is that your first trophy at Tunguska? Perhaps it will take some time. Uh, but let's just go to your fit. Wow, look at that. What the heck is a black buffalo? That is such a cool fish. Oh no, I just got rid of that. No, not you. I want to see that. Uh, wow, you got a carp to char. Holy cow. Uh, what fish was I looking for? I'm so lost checking all these fish out. Because I've never seen majority of these fish. And I don't want to ruin it for me. Uh, holy cow, what the hell was I looking for? Arctic char. It should be in the beginning. Uh, Kurai Lake. Okay, so this one was a little bit smaller. Uh, where are we right now? We're right here. Eyeless. How's it going? Good to see you once again. Uh, ooh, something's happening in the chat. Uh, near 15 meter, 92 fish, 500 silver, not bad. What? Near 15 meter hole. Yeah, today the 15 meter hole is giving us fish, I think. And I think that's because it's quite, kind of warm. And the fish have gone really in the deep end. It has cooled down, so nighttime should be more active for us. Uh, you know what? I'm going to... Right after we pass the 15 meter hole, I'm going to go back to the cafe and sell all my non-marker fish. Uh, which is a lot. A lot of fish. Wow, look at this. One kilo fish. We have so many of them. We can make huge amount of fish pieces. Uh, but apparently I need to go through like a 10 year college course in order to learn how to lay fish. This game. Uh, you're so encouraging, Jess. Thank you. <laughs> Let's see. Friendly competition, you know? Uh, when ace. Now I want to see how many people have gotten the Sivan Trout. I think that is the rarest trophy I've got so far. Uh, Alice. Is your in-game name the same thing? L-I-S? Uh, you can message me in the game or you can, if you are part of the MDoc community, you can just say something in the chat and like I can. I can just click on your name. If I was not trolling, then uh, I would. I would go on your name. Uh, trophy red? N no. N no, I, I've never seen a, tr uh, a red. I'm so confused right now. Hold on. Uh, char, you don't. S I don't think there's red char till like later on in the game. I don't know what lake it will be on. If you were talking to me, I I really don't know. But regular char, I only have like a two kg one. Trophy ghost mirror. I'm guessing ghost mirrors are extremely rare. Oh, there we go. Uh, but why is this not... Oh, okay, it's right from here. Okie dokie. What did you want me to see? I completely forgot. My my memory is just... Uh, red carp. Oh, that you Jessica was talking to you. Uh, where will that red carp be? Ha, <laughs> donuts. Uh, not a donuts, right? Amber... <gasps> Look at this! 
someone did this fish in like a Cheetos bag and it just colored it. Spicy Cheeto mix. 20 kg red Starvus, Starvus carp scaly. Holy cow, half a million XP. See, I want to go to Amber now. Uh, hold on, let me check the map. Where am I? I really want to go Amber. I can't wait. Okay, red and ghost carps are rare. Let me put this rod away. Let's just go to the cafe and let's sell the fish. Wow. So many fish I need to discover. We have 50 fish so far. And uh, so the bite rate uh, <laughs> surprisingly is good. We're getting one fish a minute. It's just the quality isn't there. Uh, 6.7 degrees. Uh, that's pretty good temperature, but... Okay, let's go ahead price wise. Let's sell uh six point eight silver. You have that many. Okay, do I have a fish on right now? I don't think so. We'll just reverse and continue on our journey. Hopefully morning time we will get some good stuff. Oh, hi, Aftab. How's it going? How's it going? Good to see you. Let's see here. Amber. The <laughs> common barbel. 8.9 kg. Holy cow, that's huge. Common carp, 23 kg. Uh, Eyed, wow. The mer carp. Basically, it's just bear, but all the fish are actually big. I think that's what I'm seeing here. <laughs> Gelicarva, uh, Mericarp. What's that, Octoba? Wild carp. Wow, there's so many fish at Octoba. Holy cow. And Lower Tungaska. Oh, wow. Blue Trophy, too. Sardine, Cisco. That's pretty cool. Uh, I'm good too, up top. Thank you for asking. I was hoping uh, Urai would be really good today because it's all sunny and to me 12 degrees is like nice weather but apparently it's still too warm. Uh, but uh, either way, I have caught 9 kg arctic char so far, 5 kg lake trout, so that will bring in a little bit of money. Uh, it could also mean, you know, maybe we can hit another big fish. No kura chars again today. Uh, so, let's see. I think my goal now is just to level up ASA ASAP so that I can finally unlock Amber and go there and try my luck there. I'm gonna unlock two maps at the same time. It's gonna be Amber and Leduga. I've never been to Sura. I just don't know what to do there. Amber though, and I believe Atuba is where people catch all the big carps. And they list all the trophies all the time. So I know that place is always like active. Like I would go to Volkov, but Volkov isn't doing too well either, so... Ah, uh, that's another Wendy's. Not even a marker. Yeah. Today is not the day. Carp. I think I saw in the chat of 
one or two who are charts were being caught. Oh, you know what? I should change my uh, lure. Uh, I should change it to uh, this black one. Or Hunter 10. I can try Hunter 10. Ooh, someone got 11 kg Starva Gaelic Carp. Let me once again check. Let me once again check uh, the weeklies here. Maybe I can switch to another lure and see. Wow, 6 kg brown trout. Holy cow. All at Balea. Heck, I can go Balea. Where is it? Urai Chars. So there's a lot of, I think all the hunters are working right now. It's not one specific hunter that's getting all the fish. And then it is the one trout. Same thing here. They are using Snatcher S003. Let me see if I have a snatcher in my inventory. Snatcher there is a three I can I can try with that too. Inventory uh snatcher zero zero three okay. Let's change it up. Uh, Terminator, Snatcher 003. I think this is the one that maintains its depth. No, I think that's a DP crank. Oh, I already have a fish on. No, I do not. Does anyone know if Volkov is doing good right now? I know it's really warm, but I'm seeing some big fish being caught. Like uh, 7.9 kg salmon. Because if this is really slow, I can go Volkov, but it's, I don't know, it's not looking good there either. Do I have points and spoon? Uh, let me check. Let me check. Just give me a second. Let me reorient this. Uh, skills. Spin fishing. Oh, what do I have it in? I have... Fishing with a spinning rod, a fishing with a reel, I do not have points anywhere else. Fishing with a spoon is zero. Uh, so this should be the next one. Volkov has been good. I guess I can go there. Uh, the hunters are working at Volkov, correct? The same hunter blues, because I might as well go there. At least get some action. Uh, Hunter one zero zero. Okay. Uh, DP cranks. Okay. I have DP cranks. How long have I been here? One hour? I think I should wrap it up right here and go to Volkov. Let's go there. And let's try our luck there. 
I know the salmons are definitely gonna give us a good fight. If we do get something big. Uh, we might also get a big... We might also get a big uh, catfish. Yeah, the 22 kg catfish I got was really scary. Oh, there we go. Nice. Um, I was using my gold S at the time. It had 50, over 50% uh, break, wear and tear. So I had to completely lock it to bring it up. I couldn't do it anywhere else. So between the islands, yeah, that has always been the hot spot. Oh, it's too bad. I spent money on the rental. Okay, let's go to Wolkov. I'm not gonna waste any more time here. It's less than ideal fishing. Ooh. See, this 10 meter hole is amazing. I wonder if I sit here, will I have better luck? Holy cow, 2.9 kg lake trout. Uh, how far are we from the 10 meter? They're close by. Oh no, this is not gonna work. This is not gonna work. Let me quickly change this to a Hunter 10. Maybe, just maybe. No, I think I'm gonna have to move the boat a little bit. Alright. It's done. Um, I'm gonna just go to Volkov. Oh, I can't wait. Yeah, well, uh, let's see how well how well I do at Volkov. Based on that, you can go there. Let me test the spot out for you. Nothing? I'm just gonna leave my rods here. I don't care. Alrighty, let's check. I doubt I have any cafe orders complete. We want trout, pike. We have two 3kg pikes. Not even close. Uh, I'd. Yes. <laughs> Yay, we got one order. 12 silver order. Uh, that's about it. So in one hour we got, look at that, 41 silver. In one hour we made, oof, 140 silver, ouch. So yeah, I think it's the right move to uh, move to Wolkov. Good luck at Amber. <laughs> I guess Tunga, Tunga got slowed down after that trophy. And Gaga was like, you know what, Jess, you got a trophy, so uh, I'm down there. Your your RNG rate is uh, is dropped now. No more good fishing for you. <laughs> uh, you know why I love Volkov? Because it's actually fair. The boat tickets are cheap. If you lose a lure or if you want to buy something, it's normal priced. Not only that, but holy cow, does this place pay up. Uh, wow, I have a two-day Volkov ticket? No, I have a one-day, what? Why is it showing me that I have... Oh, no, it doesn't. Okay. Uh, let me put on... Uh, DP Crank 6002. Okay, I think these are the things that are working. On my third rod, I will put DP crank 8. And I believe on one of these DP cranks, I have the most expensive size uh, 1 hook. See, for 4 silver 80. Compared to like 7 something. Oh crap, I got into the wrong boat. Oh no. Oh, this sounds so weak. Oh. Did I go back and change it up? Will it cost me money though? Oh, I just got this rust bucket accidentally. Ooh, I forgot about these DP cranks. They just go to their depth. Uh. Yeah. Oh, okay, weather change the Tunguska. Yeah. Do I have a fish on that? 
Yeah, I think I do. That was instant. Okay, this sound looks promising. Ooh, it's a decent sized fish too. Oh, it's a pike. 2.7 kg. Okay, this boat is garbage. It is so slow. I guess I cannot change boats, can I? Holy cow, look at that. Look at the bite rate right now. Another pike, perhaps? Ooh, uh, uh, Atlantic salmon. Look at that. Nice. This is looking promising. I'm so happy I switched. Even though it seems warm, but... Okay, what do I have here? DP crank 8. This has size 1 hook. And then my 6. One has a size 2. I believe the other one has a size 2. Okay, so the one I have right now has size 1. So the biggest fish might hit this one. Alright, we're making our way in between the islands. I always go this route and then go back and forth. I actually go like this and back. So let's see. <laughs> yeah, I've casted from that dock there I to the left. And I always catch pikes and wendays. Oh, sorry, not wendays. Uh, Xander, yes. I think I caught a 6kg Xander there. You know what? I think the trolling speed for this boat might be uh, might be well. I'm catching fish. Look the fish. It just seems this motor is gonna die soon. My right rod is getting all the fish right now. My left rod unfortunately isn't. Holy cow, this fire rate is insane right now. Ooh, what is this? A catfish. Uh-oh. I do not want catfish. Uh, let's have a pickle. I will drink tea soon enough. Uh, I'll wait till my ticket's still running there. Okay. Yeah, you know what? I had a two-hour ticket at Kurai. But it's just such sucky fishing. I'm willing to just part ways with that ticket. We're getting loads of non-marker fish and catfish. I just don't understand how we can get catfish from trolling. Uh, they're bottom feeders, so... You know, they should... You know what? People fish for them at dams. So I guess it makes sense if they do bite when you're trolling. I wonder if anyone has ever bottom fished at the 7.5 meter hole for a uh, big catfish. Yeah, this motor is seriously slow. <laughs> it's gonna take us such a long time. <laughs> Uh, oh, oh yes, DP crank aid the big fat boy. Done something here. Ooh, three point two kg Atlantic salmon. Wow, look at those teeth. Yeah, I forgot how this fish looks like, but it looks beautiful. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna check on this guy. What is wrong with you? EP crank 6002, so... <gasps> yes, 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 yes! We have a fish on! Okay, uh, I am going to drink this. Uh, I should have drank the tea first, perhaps? Oh, fully loaded. Okay. Yeah, I'm sorry guys, I don't know your in-game names and even if you tell me like five minutes later, I'll forget your name. So this is either a catfish 
or a good quality fish. Holy cow. Finally, a big fish. Finally. I am so happy for that. Uh, I'm gonna eat. Oh, wow. Uh, five in-game hours meaning, sorry, what? Five hours in at Wolkov only, or did you make like a new account? You know what? I think this is uh, a catfish that I caught. How the heck am I getting catfish? Oh man, my... Uh, I had caviar, so that should hopefully bring our energy to the maximum. Holy cow, this... Catfish, whatever the heck it is, it's not giving up. Oh, I love it. I missed fighting big fish. Oh no, my energy is just... There we go. This coffee is gonna save my life. Okay, your boat ticket. Yeah, I guess uh, when your rental is over, then you can come by. Oh, guys. My energy is still not increasing, and I just had coffee. Like, dude, what do you want from me? Okay, our energy is going up slowly. Alright, that's good. Good, our second rod has a fish too now. <gasps> what, what size is this? Wow, 6.62 kg Atlantic Salmon. It gave us such a hard fight. What? That doesn't make any sense. I have a 28 kg setup. Oh, we have an asp. Nice. Okay, let me turn the boat around so we can go in between the islands. Oh, man. I just don't understand this. Hold on, let me turn around before we look at our catch again. You know what? At least it wasn't a catfish. Uh, thank you, Jessica. <laughs> that was a nice salmon. Uh, let me turn around because it takes a million years on this boat. I accidentally took 6.6 kg Atlantic salmon. So a trophy Atlantic salmon is 12 kg. I mean, sorry, 15 kg or is it 30 kg? Because uh, that's huge. Can't imagine. Uh, how long did it take me to catch this? Uh, oh, it took me two minutes to catch this. Okay. You know what? I'm fine with that. <laughs> I am fine with that. And that was on my caliber. That was on my strongest setup. Uh, 30 kg rod, 28.5 kg line, 28.2 kg uh, leader. Yes. Thank you, Jess. I think it is active. You know, we have quite a few fish already. Uh, I think, though, it's only for today, though, that it's going to be good. Because it's 14 degrees today, tomorrow it warms up a little bit. Let's see how it goes. I'm finally going between the islands. Ooh. We have here. A small pike. That's Yeah, <laughs> people are reporting Akura is dead. Another pike. That is a marker, very nice. Uh I think I might have a fish on number one. Yes. Let me decrease the break to twenty-five. Another small pike. You know what? The trolling speed of this boat might be slower and that might be working in our favor. Uh, unless the trolling speed on all boats is the exact same. I'm not sure. 
So I've been here nine minutes. Uh, so far, very good fish. 6.6 kg salmon, 3 kg Atlantic salmon, 2.7 kg pike, and catfish. Oh, let's see how it goes. And we already have another fish on. Uh, probably a pike. No, Atlantic salmon. 2.34. Nice. Okay. Uh, we are almost at the end, so let's make a U-turn. Ooh, I have a fish on instantly. Another Atlantic salmon, unfortunately a non-marker. Uh, we might have a fish on number one here. Okay. Yeah, I think that makes sense. I think the only difference in these boats is when you... When you're not trolling, that's the only difference, perhaps. And when you shift and drive the boat, I think the red one is the fastest, and then it's the gray one uh, that we all use, and then this crappy one, unfortunately, I just accidentally got it. Uh, but it's okay. Wow, the bite rate is really good right now. Another, oh my god, yes! Oh. I just really care about XP right now. I wanna be 26. Uh, trolling speed is the same. Uh, where's the pike? Ah, I don't know. Pike usually oh, on that side. Over there, if you go close to the reeds, I think that's where I've caught a lot of pikes. Uh, over time, we will, I'm sure we'll get pikes soon enough. Yeah, this is what I love about World Cup. It's so big and open, and I've got 8 kg Atlantic salmon in 10 meter hole. I've got 8 kg ones over here, so like, it's not like as soon as you get away from the hole here, there you go, there's your pike. <laughs> it's not like... If I move away from the island, I won't catch any fish at all. I've never had that happen to me at Wolkov. That's why I love it so much. It's just so... Oh, there's another park. There you go. It's just such a fair place, I think, overall. Uh, maybe I've just never had bad luck here, you know? Maybe I've just been here at the right time. That's why I see it, it so highly. Atlantic Salmon. Nice, very nice. Uh, yeah, between the islands. Uh, oh wow, I love this bite rate. Oh, quality fish too. Oh, that's not a quality small pike. I just quickly want to see what people are catching for Atlantic Salmon in the weeklies here. Uh, weekly. Atlantic Salmon. Asps. Volkov. Okay, we're on the right track. Atlantic Salmon. That salmon. Yeah, DP Crank 2. Okay, that's that's what's active right now. Uh, pike. Okay. Very promising so far. Are we going just a tad bit? Move it here. So I've been here 14 minutes. And we have so many uh, quality fish here. 21 fish in 14 minutes or 17 minutes. I'm happy. I'm happy with the results so far. Pike, 1 kg, yay! Uh, at night time, I'm still going to troll because I don't know of any... I don't know of any bream spots or bottom fishing spots. I don't know if I want to deal with that. 
Uh, so Al Wolkov. Wolkov. I have a Xander. Uh, it was the end of the day for me. I was just trolling towards the dock to end my shift. And boom, 8.4 kg Xander. That was pretty cool. Perch, it's whatever. You, like, I've caught Perch, like... Uh, at... Yeah, at Oldberg. So, Wolkov. I really don't have any trophy I want to specifically go for. Uh, it's just that Kurai that I really want that Kurai char. That's the only thing left. Uh, let's see how much tea do I have. I have loads of tea. I have loads of food. Okay, perfect. It's quite done. Should I make a U-turn or should I keep going? I usually just go for the route and turn. I'm going to turn around. And hope for our luck here. Uh, it is 14 degrees now. Uh, it is going to be close to sunset. So perhaps fish bites will start up. I hope. Oh, a little bit over here. Yeah, lots of people catching uh, Atlantic salmon. So that is promising for us. There we go, we have a fish on. That'd be a Xander. Asp. Yes, that's an asp. Unfortunately, not a marker. Ooh, someone got a 5k Kurai char. So, at least someone's having luck there. <laughs> yeah. Catfish like. Let's see here. Woka, Donuts, Sura, Laduga, Amber, loads of famous inhabitants. Tuba loads as well. Lower Tungaska. Yeah, I think. Holy cow, 80 kg. That's pretty nice. Anything else at the lower levels? Oh, at Bear, there's a few. Ooh, grass carp, 42 kg, barbels. Kurai, Kurai, nice. An arctic char just came in, 16.9 kg. Uh, Belea, Oldberg, and that's pretty much it. Okay, we are between the islands once more. If the islands are super active, I might as well just use this small stretch then. down a little bit. Yeah. You know what? I'll see how it goes. I might just uh, fish for an hour and just call it a day. How long have I been here? Uh, 20 minutes so far. Ooh on here oh we have something on the other one as well I'm just gonna stop the boat for now Atlantic salmon nice this motor is just gonna shut down on me <laughs> uh, wow look at that two kg Atlantic salmons uh, are these valuable fish like 
I know at Kura, majority of the fish are small, but as long as they're markers, they really add up. So, I'm gonna stay in between these islands only. I'm getting very nice fish here. Someone's asking if you guys are getting bites at Amber. Okay, so I'm in a good seller. Okay, that's good. Uh, yeah, this <laughs> motor is working. Uh, yeah, it's bringing in the fish, so uh, no complaints. Let me just turn around a little bit more. Okay. I'd love to catch a marker asp. Hmm. Let's see here. Maybe I should stick a little bit to this side. I think it's the same. Oh, we have a fish on. Is it a pike? Atlantic salmon. Oh, a non marker. Ooh, acid cat. With 7.332 kg Atlantic Salmon. Uh, how big is ours? 6.6. Uh, .6. Okay. Huh. Maybe you should start picking up? The sun's going down. Hey, fully loaded. Nice, Atlantic Salmon. 4.77 kg. Loads of people getting it. Uh, what other fish are there here? There's definitely Asp, but that's more on the rare side. So Atlantic Salmon and Xander are like the main fisher and Pike. I think these species, these three species. That's about it, the looks of it. Ooh, I got something. Ike. It's a marker. Yeah, I think everyone is doing well at Wolkov, so that's good news. Pike. <laughs> Someone got a 19 kg catfish. Oh, already. Nice. Okay, marker pike. Ooh, our second one finally got something. It's so weird. Exact same setup on both. But... A perch. It's a marker, so it's okay. I think the asp are a little bit further away from the island. That's the feeling I get. Oh. We got something. Oh, nice size. 3.1 kg. How big that is. Uh, all of a sudden, we have one row of markers here. I've been here 24 minutes, 32 fish so far. So, we're going really well. I'm worried about tomorrow, though. It's going to be warm tomorrow.
So, yeah, that works out. Okay. I'm gonna buy it in tuna pop up. Uh, squid, corn, arctic, tuna dip. Some fancy food for the fish. Yeah, I still need a lot of XP to go. What was my XP when I got here? 700,000, now I'm at 0.73. Not sure, I don't remember. Could this be a Xander? No. Atlantic Salmon. Oh, we have fish on. Oh, no, 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 no. What could this be? Uh, pike. Wow, pike all the way out here. Pike, another pike. Uh, I think I should make a U-turn right now. Uh, 26 minutes and look at that. So many markers already. Uh, some nice sized fish as well. Unless I hook a big catfish. Because I have hooked a big catfish even this far out. Uh, usually the big catfish to me would make sense if they sit right beside the dam. And in that 7.5 meter hole. Oh, Amber slowed down. <laughs> no. Oh, this game. Uh. Yeah, I'm seeing another Kurai char. Village added again. It's just some people have better luck. It's so random. Kura, unfortunately, it's sunny. And it's 12 degrees. To me, that's amazing weather. But I think 11 or 10 degrees might be, or single digits might be even hotter. Uh, in terms of fishing. Good thing we don't have to pay fuel for fuel in their boat rental. I guess the rental fee covers all of that. <laughs> Insurance, life wests, unless that stuff doesn't exist in Russia, because we are in Russia. Oh. Uh, eight meter hole. Oh, isn't there uh, an eel spa right now at Wokov? I think there is. I can just throw out one rod for eel and I can keep trolling with two rods on this. And then when I come back, maybe there might be a fish on. I don't expect anything huge to uh, take away my line. Asp. Yay! We got it. A marker asp. Uh, not a lot of XP though. Uh, you need 1.2 million XP for Tunguska. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I think I heard of active eel spa, but I don't know if I want to try that out. I don't know where it is anyway. Ooh, another fish. Fully loaded uh, with an asp double the size of what I just got. Oh. 
<laughs> Oops, I did not lock the reel. There we go. Oh yes. Got another fish on this. Looks like somewhat of a decent size. Oh yes. And I the 2.6 kg. Yes. Unfortunately my uh my my uh, XP bonus finished, uh, but it's okay. I think if you take it too many times, it hurts your health. So do not want to mess about. Nice. Okay, uh, 39 fish in 30 minutes. That buy rate is insane. We have almost two rows of markers. Again, amazing. Uh, we have nice sized fish as well. You have 6.6 .6 kg and the rest are 3 and two, all the way to 2 kg. Uh, so that's pretty darn good. Weekly record? Ultralight Kurai Char, 1.32 kg. <laughs> Sammy. Uh two point four kg barbel. Nice. Barbel are very nice fish to catch because they're small so they don't put up a fight at all. And they're worth a lot. Unless I'm wrong and they fight a lot. So far up to like what the three kg barbels I've got, it's uh absolutely nothing in terms of fighting power. Oh whoops. Not paying attention. Oh, that was close. Do I fish on this guy or is he just... Duck. Oh, we have a fish on. Okay. Pike? Ooh, a baby perch. Oh, yep. Let's see here. I'm aching for a big fight with a fish. Nighttime it slows down, so the best thing you can ask for is a huge fight where you're fighting the fish the entire night. I don't think I have any other type of BP crank. Any other color do I? I have ooh 9003 DP crank. I think that's on the weekly as well. I can try that on my third rod. I just need to uh asp. Holy cow, look at this. Okay, Wolkov is just one. Atlantic salmon. Uh what else do we have here? Okay, I can try the other DP crank as well. Ooh, fully loaded, nice pike, 7.9 kg pike. And I have a decent sized fish on this one. Okay, could be a 2-3 kg. Ooh, that's a big pike, 6.4 kg, wow. I guess the pike are biting a lot now. <laughs> it's sunset time. Oh yeah, I'm supposed to change this lure here. Let me change it to another DP crank. Yeah, that's very nice. Was it much of a fight for you? 7.9? I guess if you're aggressive at them early on, they come in really easily. That's my experience from fishing for them at Oldberg. Uh, but if they get away, then uh, holy cow, it'll take time. 
Okay. Yeah, I knew it. Uh, that's where I've always caught Pike, and that seems like the ideal spot. What I'll do is I'll just make a U-turn here at the 8 meter, and I'll just go around this island. Maybe we'll catch uh, a big sander there, perhaps. Another Atlantic salmon. Oh, oh man, this is so good. And we have another fish on. So I think when I got here, I was at 0.7 uh, million XP. So I have gained 40,000 XP so far. Oh, wow. Okay, 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 okay. Alrighty, boy. Alrighty. Please. Don't overheat my line. Please don't. Uh, maybe a 6 kg Atlantic Salmon? Hmm. Yeah, on the Alpha. If you get them quick, it's... You'll be surprised at how big you get with ease, but... Okay, this might be a 7 kg perhaps, Atlantic Salmon. Okay. Oh, I don't even have my light on. Well, there we go. <laughs> I finally have a small fight here. Could be a long fight, I, I don't know. But, uh, keeps thing interesting. Okay, I need to drink. Ooh. What did Sophie Ray just catch? Someone's asking if that's her biggest fish. And it is her biggest fish. Ah, damn it. I just had to eat something, didn't I? <laughs> uh, it just sucks when all of a sudden there's a lot of slack. <laughs> I have a super quality. <laughs> yeah, if that fish decides to like hit its side on the boat, oh, we're gonna sink. <laughs> uh. The longer this fish fights for, the greater its size is gonna be. Uh, the longer the fight, the happier I get, I guess. But it's also very stressful because after 10 minutes of fight, the fish might unhook itself and I will start to cry. Or I could lose my energy if I don't maintain it well. Uh, but this is what I wanted. Holy cow, she was fighting it for two and a half in real life hours. What the heck did she catch? Oh, someone caught an eel. <laughs> okay. Eel on DP crank? That's what he caught it on? Holy cow. Yeah, I have to uh, keep an eye on the heat. Oh, my energy is starting to fall now. I think the fish has weakened a bit. Not running. It doesn't have those bursts anymore, which is good.
I really hope this is like a 10 kg fish. I really do. I have a feeling it's going to be like a 6 kg Atlantic salmon. Even a 29 break on a 28 kg setup. Holy cow, is this thing still running? Uh, what could this be? Imagine if this is a trophy asp. Oh. That'd be amazing. Oh, hell no. <laughs> I know 100% this is not a catfish. Because uh, it's running way too much. When I caught my first ever catfish, well not the first ever, but the first big catfish for the 22 kg, like I mentioned, uh, it was on this gold S, my breaks were 50% done. I had that, uh, you know the top, rightmost arrow above the green line here? That thing became yellow and I freaked out, I'm like uh oh, something is wrong with my setup or something. And Jess is like, yeah, your, your break something is worn out over 50%, that's when you get that. And I'm like, oh, and it was so scary because that stupid catfish doesn't move. And I'm like, am I stuck on the ground? Is the hook stuck on the ground or what? Okay, our energy is really good right now. Our hunger just came down a little bit, which means I can throw in another coffee or tea if need be. <laughs> Thanks, yes, I really hope so. I don't think so because I've never really caught a big ass, but so I don't know how they fight. This to me looks like an Atlantic salmon. Uh, but I'm no expert. I think the fish might be done here. I could be wrong though. Asps don't really run, do they? I hope you get a nice cat as well. Uh, can you believe it? For so many hours, for like, I don't know, 50 to 100 hours, my biggest fish was a 19 kg grass carp at, from Old Berg. And I went to Bear so many times, spent hours there, never caught anything close to that size. And I come here to Wolkov, trolling, minding my own business, boom. I get a catfish, I'm like, oh crap, what do I do now? I pull it out and it's my biggest fish, 22 kg. And I wasn't even aiming for it. That's that's how funny it is. But that was that was a very scary fight. But in the end, I was really happy. Uh, cause oh crap, I am overheating. Wow, this fish has crazy fight in it. Holy cow, it's still fighting. This is scary. Okay, I still have the fish on. That's good. Why am I reeling it in so much now? Okay, I still have the fish. Please don't tell me this is a catfish. No, running too much. A cat on crack. <laughs> Why do you want me to catch a catfish? <laughs> Oh wow, common barbel, 9.5 kg. And this fish is still fighting. I really don't want to max out my brakes. Uh, yeah, you're right. I already have a trophy Xander, so I'm hoping it's something else. <laughs> but you know what, I will take a trophy any day. Because they are worth a lot of money too. Is this fish done? Please. Please tell me it's done. Did I raise my rod? I'm just worried I might unhook the fish if I raise my rod. Am 
my energy is still good. Okay, that's not a worry. See, I love this. Uh, I spent the whole night trying to catch this fish here. And uh, however much money this fish brings in, uh, in my mind, I don't think I would have made this much money if I didn't have a fish this big. Man, people are catching eels, and someone just caught an eel on DP Crank. Obviously very random, but that would be super sweet if I got an eel. Okay, can I bring this in now? It's acting like a- oh my god! Holy cow, did you guys see that? That is an Atlantic Sam, that's a huge one! I don't think it's a trophy though. It it didn't run hard enough, at least in my mind. Holy cow, we came so close. Uh oh, get it, get it, get it, no! Damn it! I hate this net. I mean, it can be a, an 8 or 9 kg Atlantic Salmon. It just, it looks super big. Oh, see on my caliber, I still don't have a fish on. So. Oh, I really want to lock up my break. Oh, that's more than 10 kg. Alright, I hope so. Oh my god, this thing still has power. Yeah, it's not wise to uh, lock up. <laughs> Please, 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 please. No, 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 no. Quickly, quickly. Yes. Oh my god, 14 kg. Please don't tell me 15 kg is a trophy. <laughs> no. This is exactly what happened with the Kurai char. 13.99 kg Kurai char. And 15 kg is a trophy. Uh, but that was an amazing fight. I'm super happy, even if I was 1kg off. Uh, same like your trophy. Yeah. Uh, let's see if anything on the caliber. Yeah, it is something on the caliber. Nice. That salmon is going to bring in such good money. Oh, this was perfection. The entire night, we are fighting this fish, and the nighttime is, you know, slow. And that's what I've always wanted, so... Okay, you know what? I think trophy might be 30 kg then. Uh, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much, guys. <laughs> uh, yeah, I think then 30 kg. Let me quickly check the weeklies then. Oh. Oh, we got something on this right away. Right away. Okay, 20 kg is a trophy. Yeah, that seems more reasonable then. Holy cow, 4 k Guys, we're gonna make some good money here. Holy cow. Oh, that was beautiful. I'm so happy I went through that fight. It's something for the stream as well. <laughs> uh, yeah, let's quickly check uh, the trophy section here. Not the trophy, the weekly. What did I catch? Atlantic Salmon? Yeah, you know what? Tro trophy is 20 kg because the biggest fish right now is 27.9 kg. Uh, so yeah, if you're not having any luck at Kurai, just, uh, just come to Volkov. It's really, really well right now. <laughs> uh, yeah, we'll cough. But you know what? Uh, today, though, it's going to be 17 degrees. I was fishing in 14 degree weather, and uh, look at that. Uh, I've been hit. I have 47 fish. It's been 49 minutes. Uh, let's see how long it took me. Holy cow. 
It took me 12 minutes to reel in this 14 KT, and that's on a gold S. Uh, but look at the quality of the fish here. The 14 KD, 6.6 KD, 6 KD, 4 KD, 3, 3, 3, 3, 3, 3, 3. Uh, so World Cup has been really good. Uh, let's hope now that it's warm, uh, we still get fish. Oh, I completely forgot to go in between the island for pike. <sighs> yeah. Hope you guys get a trophy at least. And I can share it on the stream. I'll go to your profile and I'll show everyone what you just caught. Yeah. <laughs> uh, you know what? Let me just turn around. And let me go through that island again. And let's go through that pike spot. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, that's gonna be such good money, I can't wait. It is a beautiful morning at Volkov. And we are steering clear of the dam. I seriously want to bottom fish one day over here at 7.5 meter hole for a big catfish. But I feel like I'm not gonna get it. Ooh, look, another 1.395 kg asp. I think that's the exact same size as I just caught, right? Asp. By weight. Oh, that's all. Okay, that's very close. Another asp. We are going to make a killing. I'm gonna go ahead and say. Uh, we've been here not even an hour. And a look at how many marker fish we've got. We got some huge fish as well. Well, I mean one huge fish, but uh, we have an entire day ahead of us. Let's see how that goes. It's 8.7 degrees as well. It's nice and cool right now. And this boat is still holding. Uh, <laughs> chances of it capsizing are extraordinarily high, but uh, we're hanging in there. Okay, I'm gonna go through this island here and I'm gonna make a turn here. Perhaps we can get a Xander on this side. Uh, Cause I always get them on that side. Okay, I think we will be turning pretty soon. Oh, we have a fish on. Could this be a small non marker? <laughs> if I get a hundred fish, I will sink the boat. Uh, possibly. It will either sink or we just won't move because it just does not have the power move this much weight. I think I'd have a fish on this one. No. And I'm going to change uh, the lure on this because this guy isn't getting us anything. Uh, DP crank 8 it is, I guess. Okay, are we going through this island here? Let me just turn around. Perfect. Wow, it is so laggy here. All these reeds. Here we go. Might have a pike on that one. Wow, I've never had this much lag here before. Oh my god. Okay, we're cutting it a little too close here. I've never had this much lag. Oh, that wasn't even a pike. And we are getting fish after fish. That's an asp, isn't it? No, oh, that's a pike.
Okay. No big pikes here. So far. Pikes are scary though. They just go by so quick like a missile. Uh, they can overheat your line. Overheat your reel, I mean. Very easily. Let's see, I will guarantee you we're gonna catch one Xander at least. I don't know if it's gonna be a marker, but on this side, we have to catch a Xander. Uh, I think Xander is the only thing I don't have that's a marker. We have a marker asp, we have marker this, marker catfish, marker eyed, marker perch, uh, marker pikes, and but no marker Xander. Uh, let's aim for that as well then. Oh, what do we have here? Ooh, what? That is a tiny Xander. There we go already. Uh, Xander really liked the outer sunny side of the island. Okay, time to turn around. And go right by those reeds over there. Ah, uh, ooh, leader is broken. Okay, that's not too bad. Hey, uh... <sighs> reloaded, right? Clem? No, Dijon is uh, reloaded. Sorry, Clem, are you having any luck at Volkov? Are you here yet? I have fish on both of my rods right now. Oh, you got a snag in there. <laughs> Oops. That's a good start to the day. <laughs> Are you able to get rid of it or is it the relog type of snags? Let's make sure. I don't think you can snag during rolling, can you? Hey, M Dog is here. You have a fish on. Oh, that sucks. You need to relog. <laughs> Clem, I really hope you get a barbel. Uh, I'm surprised how often I got them on potatoes. Uh, but again, it's so random. Let's hope you get a barbel. And I'm hoping to get a marker Xander. I feel I'm in the right place. Are you at bear, Clem? Oh yeah, yeah. The I think people call them phantom, uh, phantom snag or ghost snags. They're called. <gasps> Look at that. Five point six eight. I caught that fish so early that it wasn't even a fight. Holy cow! Five point six kg. Another quality, guys. This one is right on the surface as well. Xander, uh. Please give me a marker, Xander, please. Yeah, I hate those types of uh, snags. Uh, the only way of telling them is uh, you have to press R. Okay, so she caught a 32 kg cat on a 10 kg uh, setup. 
So that must be painful. Uh, okay, you're still at Amber. Yeah, I I saw the weeklies and Amber is the place with all the big bubbles, so Okay, we need to turn a little bit here. Oh, we have a fish on both of these. Holy cow. Man, Volkov is amazing today. Even though, well, it's 10 degrees right now. <gasps> yes! Yes! A marker Xander 2.285 kg. Finally, I knew it was going to be on this side. <laughs> I'm so happy. Uh, small goals, guys. Keep them small. And it's easier for you to achieve them. And you are brought happiness. So... My next goal would have been to get a fish that was over 10 kg and we have already caught that at Volkov. So thank you for giving me a very good time, Volkov. You know what? This rusted boat might be good luck. <laughs> uh. Uh, I hope it's a good amount of silver. I think I will most likely average over 300 silver per hour. So we have three rows of markers right now. You know what? I think it might just, just be 300 silver per hour. I don't have a lot of markers. I've been here one hour so far. Okay. We finally got a marker, Xander. Oh yeah. I will most likely have to go back to the cafe and sell all the non-markers as well. We have 64 fish. Uh, let's check the weather. Let's hope it stays cool. Oh, it's gonna be 17, ouch. Lots of people getting asps as well. Nice sized asp. Uh, so I think we have a chance of getting um, nice sized ones and good money as well. Okay, we are down at the 8 meter hole. Let's see if we can get something here. Oh. Well, the weekend just turned around for us, for me at least. <laughs> Uh, Kurai was really slow. Initially, the main reason for the whole stream was that I go back to Kurai and I finally try for another Kurai char. Uh, but it's all weather permitting. Kurai was sunny and 12 degrees, but I guess it just wasn't cool enough. So I ended up coming to Volkov. And it seemed Volkov was too warm as well. Uh, but I was willing to take that risk and, uh, oh, we got a chub. 1.56 kg chub, holy cow. This is amazing. Look at how many species of fish and every single species that we've caught, we have a marker. Uh, so yeah, I decided to not do a repeat of last weekend and that was just staying at Kurai and not getting anything. So we finally came, came to Wolkov and uh, it's been good so far. We ha I've had one big battle. And let's see if we can get another one. Oh yeah, I wanted to see how much wear and tear I have on my gold 80 now. After that fight. Uh, gold 80 is at 1%. But what it doesn't show us is how much wear and tear is on the brake and on the mechanism and stuff like that. Alright, I think it's time we go into the island now. Pumpkin Sunfish, that's such a nice name. <laughs> I 
I really hope on Sunday, tomorrow, uh, the weather in Kurai steps up again. Because I'd really like to go there and get that trophy. Uh, fish should still be active. How's Amber doing for you? Jessica, I forgot where you are. Uh, did you come to Amber as well, I think? After Tunguska weather changed, right? All of a sudden, it's quiet down. Maybe I'm just way too close to the island. <clears throat> Fine though. 65 fish in 1 hour 6 minutes. And we have 14 kg fish. 1.7 kg all the way. Oh, <laughs> thank you, Jess. <laughs> I'm happy I, uh, some of you guys find me entertaining. That's the whole purpose of the stream. Uh, but after, you know, the last three streams, I've been feeling a lot of pressure. Because uh, last weekend, you know, after two weeks, two weeks of such good fishing at Kurai, it just died all of a sudden. And then I went to Bear. I had a good time there, constant fish. So I was like, you know what, that's entertaining for the stream. And then I got absolutely nothing on that stream as well. I went to Oldberg and I think I've never had a fishing day that bad at Oldberg. Even when I was new, I caught more fish. And I think I caught like 12 fish in one hour and I only made like, how much silver did I make? I think I, think I didn't even break a hundred silver. And that was just so bad. Uh, so I was definitely feeling the pressure when I started streaming today. But I'm really happy. Volkov delivered. Yeah, I'm gonna turn a left. We need to go on that side of the island. Um, uh, nothing to write home, but it's okay. Amber been silent. Mm. It's weird. Tunguska was doing well, then it died down. Amber, I think at one point today, was doing well, people were saying, and then all of a sudden that slowed down. I can risk it by going closer to the dam. And getting a catfish <laughs> but then I'm gonna regret it if it's like a 30 kg catfish really don't want that everyone says uh, they wear your gear out a lot and they hardly pay enough for it so it's like a loss no matter what size you get it Wow, 24 kg common carp trophy uh, so trophy size on the common carp is like 20 kg. Wow. That must have paid very well because I know common carps are like one of the best paying carps. Alrighty. What can this be? Oh my god, that's so tiny. Asp. Ooh, we have a fish on this as well. Looks like a decent sized fish. And 2 kg. Okay, good, good. We now have 68 fish. Oh. Pretty soon. Gonna have to go back. Oh, some fish went for it. 
and then it just unhooked itself. I need to buy a bigger bag that can stuff more than a hundred fish in. I can't imagine stuffing in a hundred fish in a bag. Probably like a big round net. Especially the 15 kg. Oh yeah, guys, I have a question. Okay, you see this record total late for one day, 137 kg. What is this? How is this calculated? Because there have been day days I've fished for so many hours, I've caught, you know, way much over this. So is this the weight of your first 100 fish that you've caught or something like that? Or what? what is it? I don't understand. If you know the answer, I'd appreciate it. Okay, yeah. Do you remember how much that common carp was? That trophy? Uh, let's venture further out here. Although I have a feeling in between the island is the best, best place for us. Uh, okay, 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 I got it. So, the most amount, oh, for one day, I got it. So, uh, okay, so basically in one hour real life time, how many kgs worth of fish are you catching total? Okay, I get it. That makes so much sense. Thank you for that. What is this? Another, ooh, 2 kg, yes. As long as they're markers, I will keep them. 140 silver, okay. <laughs> 140 silver, okay, okay. Another one over there. Another, oh, uh, non mark. 150 is pretty good. I remember when I caught a trophy grayling. That was my most expensive fish for a little while. And it was, I believe, it was 93 silver or 99 silver. And I was still new to the game, and I was like, oh my god, that's worth so much. And I was so happy. <laughs> Look how far I've come. Uh, the one trout 10kg, 330 silver. Holy cow. I wonder when I'll beat this record. I imagine it's going to be a very long time. Unless I go to Amber, fight a fish for like an hour, and I make more money than this. But uh, that was amazing. Uh, this grass carp 30 kg again this was at bear uh, a few days ago that was pretty sweet oh wow a baby xander no? okay. uh, what I wish in the stats that we show is you see the most risky catch 10 kg I wish they would show the your setup because I caught this 10 kg grass carp on a 5.5 kg lacerti at Old Berg. And I want to see people's stats too. Like, you know, this doesn't mean anything. It's 10 kg fish, so what? Uh, there's no point for it. Okay, uh, one hour in a real life time here. 46 fish and 339 silver. Yeah. Volkov is amazing. I love Volkov. It's steady uh, with its pay rate. Like, I've always had 300 silver of fish per hour average. And, uh, yeah. I can't say anything bad about Volkov. Urai, uh, when it's active, holy cow. I've made four to four. 
400 is the maximum I've made per hour. I made 800 and something silver in two hours. And that's, I think, the highest I've ever made. Uh, but when Kurai is not active, it's just really not active. <laughs> so that's good. I'm happy you made 339 silver. It's paying up for everyone. Although in chat, I'm not seeing a lot of... Atlantic Simons anymore, which means it has slowed down. Uh, mainly because, like I mentioned, it's warm right now. 15.5 kg uh, degrees Celsius. We have a tiny fish on this. What could you be? Ooh, a clam. A river mussel. Oh, it's a non-marker. Okay, let's turn around here. I'm not getting much. Holy cow. Yeah, you got the 9 kg pike. 44 silver. Okay. Yeah, the rest were... So, I'm pretty sure the rest of the fish were like, what? Around 2 to 3 kg, right? Markers. And they all make up eventually. But uh, that's why I'm so happy whenever I get markers. As long as I keep getting markers and not non-markers, they all add up. I think I need to drink tea soon enough. Better turn around. There we go. Ooh. Oh, we got something. We got something. Uh, let's be extra aggressive right at the beginning. We can unhook the fish easily at this point, but oh, that's a pike. Never mind. Four kg. I want a big fight. A Xander. Baby Xanders. Holy cow, you got an 18 kg common carp on a Lizardi. How long was that fight? Uh, 3 kg asps and under 5 kg salmon. Uh, yeah, basically that's the same thing with me. If you look, a 13, 14 kg Atlantic salmon, 6.6 .6 kg, okay, pike and salmon. And then the rest are 3 kg. And then another full line of 2 kg and another line of 1 to 2 kg. I think that's maybe 300 for that hour. Another asp? No, that's a pike. Okay, I want to see how long I've been fishing for here. Uh, 1 hour 18 minutes. I think at 2 hours I will conclude and uh, see how much we earned in the 2 hours. It'll be a nice, nice round figure for us. It's easy to calculate. Unless it's really slow, then I'll just cut it short. <laughs> yeah. A fish that big, you are going to be running for a long time. My longest fight so far has been 20 minutes. That's it. And I'm happy with that. I, I, I really don't want to spend one full hour fighting a fish. I cannot imagine. There we go. We got something here. Looks like a non-marker, but yeah. Basically, all of these non-marker fish, you can make so many fish pieces. You can make two fish pieces per fish here. No, this is three fish pieces. Holy cow, you can end up with so many fish pieces. Uh, that obviously, if your skill is high enough for that. 
All right, we're coming in between the islands. Let's pray we got something here. I'm gonna drink one tea. Ooh, 4.6 KD Xander. Holy cow, we got something here. Let's quickly bring this up here. So we don't let it go deep down. And that's a 2 KD. Oh, 4.5 KD. Nice. Okay, that is quality fish there. Uh, this island is hang up <laughs> in between this, these islands. Uh, so when I broke my rod, it was right here. I got something huge and it was running so fast. And I squirreled up my brakes and I unfortunately locked it and boom, instantly my rod just exploded. And that sucked. Uh, so in the stats, you can see one broken rod here. And what happened was, if I press V, so what happened was I had a 15.5 kg rod. Okay, I had a gold ADS on it. I had, uh, I guess I had a bigger line here and my weakest point was the leader. But everyone said, oh, uh, go and put 28 kg leader on it. That's the minimum or else a pike is going to bite it off. So I was like, okay, fine. Now, my, uh, you know, my setup is very risky. But I'll be careful, I won't uh, lock up my reel. And guess what happened? I locked up my reel. Instantly exploded my rod. Uh, but it wasn't actually that bad. It's a 15.5 kg rod. And which is like what, 289 silver? And I make that amount in one hour here. It wasn't that big of a deal. Nice hot friend. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Uh, let's see if we can't get something big here. It's uh, sun is going to be setting in a bit. We have some time. I keep forgetting the difference between dusk and dawn because I never use it. Use that term. Uh, dusk is when the sun is setting. No, it's dawn is when the sun is setting. That's why I never say it. I'm like, yeah, it's uh, it's sunset time. <laughs> <laughs> That's so sad. Oh, we got something on this guy. Uh, one, two, three. Okay, uh... What? This thing here? Uh, if you click the, you'll be able to see the percentage of your reel and other rig. Oh, 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 oh. We got something. Okay. Gonna be extra aggressive here. If the fish unhooks it, unhooks, it's okay. I wouldn't be sad about it. Uh, but I feel right at the beginning, if we can bring it up. We get that advantage. Holy cow, this might be another big fish. Uh, break is 29 and it was almost at the orange. And this is the caliber. This is my big boy setup. <laughs> oh my god, our other rod has something on it too. Yes. Oh, that was a quick one. 6.69. Wow, so many high quality fish today. Holy cow. Uh, I think you mean the cobweb? Yeah, uh, cob, the cob. Atlantic Salmon 2kg. Holy cow, this place is amazing today. Yeah, just give me a second. Let me just reorientate, reorient myself. Oh my god, another fish. Ooh, what is this? Atlantic Salmon. It looks like a really thin fish and I'm like, is that an eel? Okay, that was amazing. All right, so uh, you mean this, right? Oh crap! Yes, you're right. Uh friction break eleven percent wear and tear. Oof. 
Okay, let me go ahead and see my caliber. Caliber, my baby. Uh, caliber, no wear and tear on it. Uh, because all the fish love going after my weaker, my weaker reels. Oh man, non marker. Wow, we are at 84 fish, guys. That's just an insane bite, bite rate. Eid. Hey. Hello, Eid. Good to see you again. <laughs> yes. <laughs> it's just so white. It's like a fresh. It, it looks fresh. <laughs> uh, what about our other alpha? 11%. Uh, okay. Not too bad. Oh, wow. Already another bite. Uh, 1.2 kg. Uh oh, we're at 86 fish now. So it's becoming night time and it's gonna slow down, and that's when I'm just gonna go in the cafe and sell our fish here. Look at the amount of markers we have. Holy cow! <laughs> 14 kg, 6.6 kg, 6.6. This whole row is really good. Oh, we're gonna make some good money. And good stuff. Thank you, thank you. And another marker, please. Yes, 2.4. And I'm at 800,000 XP. Uh, so I've gained 800,000 XP uh, when I got here, uh, which is great. Ooh. So I think, I think Kurai, uh, Lake Kurai, you can get more XP. 2.7 kg, holy cow. Uh, because if you catch Kurai Chars, holy cow, are they massive amount of XP. So. Uh. Would you guys like to see me stream tomorrow as well? I don't know if I should stream tomorrow. I really don't know where to stream. If I see Kurai is chilly and it's sunny, then I might stream because it's nice weather. If not, then uh, I'm just not going to even bother playing this game. Yeah, after a while uh, with bottom fishing, your spot just dries out. That's what I don't like about it. Uh, so yeah, change the spot. I think people say change the lure as well and that will work. I'm gonna make a U-turn here in the 8 meter hole. Someone wants to go green fishing at night here. I'm not gonna do that. It is almost 5 p.m. here, Eastern Standard Time. I need to see how long have I been here for a one and a half hour almost. So half more, half an hour left, and then we will wrap the stream up. Okay, come. <laughs> Great. Uh, FP4 or RF4? Hi Tatwis, so good to see you again. How is your weekend going so far? Uh, Pike. Okay, another marker. Let's see if we can't get any big fish here. Uh, Tatwis, unfortunately, Kurai was very slow. It was sunny. Uh, but it's 12 degrees there and apparently that's just too warm for the fish you see this uh, and I was just not getting much 
Uh, so I just came to Volkov. Volkov seems to be a little warm, but holy cow, look at this. Uh, I've been here one and a half hours so far, and this is what we've caught so far. Uh, 14 kg Atlantic salmon, 6.6 .6 kg, 6.6, 6, 5, 4, and there's just so many markers today. Uh, I think we will make a good amount of money uh, for the two hours I'm here. So, <laughs> RF4. Yeah, okay, okay. Yeah. Oh! Congratulations, Tawis. I was prom. <laughs> yeah, now, now the fish at, in RF4 are endangered now that you're free. Uh, if you don't mind me asking, uh, where are you? Are you in the US? Are you... What country are you from? A 20 kg mirror carp at Bear Lake. <laughs> Thomas, I streamed three days ago at uh, Bear. And bananas were hot at that spot. 55.63. I got a 30 kg grass carp on potatoes. Uh, and I just... Caught a lot of mares, mare carps, but they were all under 10 kg size. So I just don't understand what's going on. So I'm really happy you got a 20 kg uh, mare there. And uh, when I was streaming, it was just terrible. I got nothing. Uh. <laughs> okay. Well, what I failed to what. I failed to catch you got so good at least someone at least someone got it so <laughs> I'm happy yeah I'm so happy I made the decision of coming to Volkov uh, it's paid off huge uh, so let's see half hour left let's see what else we can get maybe we can get another fight during the night here Ooh. Okay, congratulations. Uh, Luthania, is that how you pronounce it? Europe, huh? So what time is it at your place? Is it is it like early, early morning right now there? Yeah, you must be tired. Holy cow. How is the whole virus situation? It's, uh, it's scary. I'm not even going to bother talking about US, but here in Canada, I believe in September school is supposed to start. Uh, but I don't know. If one kid has it, then... Uh, oh, oh yes. The caliber is getting it today. Holy cow. Oh, we got a fish on. All is at sunset time. Oh, the slack. Oh, yeah. Definitely looks like maybe Atlantic salmon. That's the only big fish I think that can push it. We are at 91 of 100 fish already. Okay. Ah! Please don't run. No! Oh my god, this fish is too big. I just don't want it to overheat my line. Because when it starts doing that, I have to lower my break and then I have to increase my break, and that's where the riskiness happens that I might accidentally lock it up and uh, break my leader. Oh man. Uh, I don't know guys, what do, what fish does this feel like? I don't know if this feels like an Atlantic Salmon, uh, but it's too early to tell. Holy cow, it's really running. It is scary when you're pumping up the brakes. Oh man, this could be a pike because it's ran so far out. Uh, damn it, I think it's going to overheat my line again. Okay, so basically I'm not going to bother eat to eat, I'm just going to feed myself tea. 
right? Or... It's a salmon? Okay. Oh my god, my other rod is ticking to... This is not good. What I've done in the past is... I will holster this rod and I will tend to my other rod and by the time I come back to this rod, it's gone. The fish is gone. It's unhooked itself. Oh no. What do I do guys? Oh man, it's still overheating. Holy cow, I'm in trouble. I'm in so much trouble right now. Yeah, this is on the caliber. This is much bigger fish easily. Uh, I just don't want to get spooled on that line because that's an expensive lure and and leader too. Holy cow, my leader is going to go too. I've never been spooled before. I just want to put this rod down, get the other rod and just increase the break. Well... What a predicament I'm in. Okay, the other one isn't ticking anymore, so it's probably because it was beside an island, perhaps. Okay, this fish is really running, and it's far away. Holy cow. Uh, my energy is increasing, so I'm gonna not feed myself tea. Big salmon? Yeah, okay. All right, uh, <laughs> when my other rod started to start ticking, oh man, I, that's when the stress started to come. Okay, all right, I got it. I'm not going to put it down. Yeah, this break is going all the way to orange. And I think with that 14 kg salmon, I don't think it was going orange, was it? I don't remember. Uh, so that's an indication that this is bigger. I'm going to turn my light on too. I keep forgetting. Okay, my energy is going down. Let's see what this is. Oh my god, once again guys, at sunset, I'm always like, listen, nighttime it gets slow. So the best scenario for everyone is right at sunset, you get a huge fish and you battle it the entire night. And that's exactly what happened two nights in a row. Oh, Wolkov, thank you. Okay. <laughs> uh, let's see what we get. Uh, I think I have an extra ticket as well. We have, I believe, half hour left. So I, I, I'm not worried. Okay, there we go. And I just keep reeling in it 24-7. I know people say don't do that because it wears your gear out more. Uh, but all of a sudden when the slack is there and it starts swimming towards you, that's a huge chance of it to unhook itself. So I just reel it in 24-7. Uh, this fish is taking us on a tour of Volkov. Uh, it's trying to, I don't know, the, the romantic night. You know, the, the moon is out. Just wants to put out a candlelight dinner for us and... Uh, uh. <laughs> uh, okay, so it's not overheating our line, which is great. Uh, our other rod is ticking sometimes, but it's fine. Okay, we, we got this under control. Our energy is good too. This rusty boat, honestly, it's amazing. <laughs> uh, and this fish is not giving up. This is what I wanted at Kurai. Big fights. When you have a fight this big at Kurai, it's 100% trophy. Trophy Arctic, Trophy Atlantic. No, sorry, Trophy uh, Lake. Lake Trout, right? I think I might start heating up again. 
or a trophy Sevan Trout or preferably a trophy Kuraichar. Well, I'm gonna get that Kuraichar someday, damn it. Not giving up on it. <laughs> oh my god. Don't even talk about this boat. It was an accident, okay? If that motor quits, oh my god. <laughs> this motor... I would rather prefer this boat sinks than just the motor kicks out. Like, I want this thing at the bottom of the lake if that happens. Our energy's good. Uh, the fish isn't... Not coming away from us too fast, so we don't have to worry about overheating as well. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Yeah, that fish is gonna take us to safety. Yeah. And if it's a catfish, it's gonna pull us down to the lake ground. <laughs> to the bottom. Uh... Uh, the first time I ever got a catfish was at Old Berg. I was fishing for eel. I threw it right by the lilies. And uh, I just got this fish and I'm like, oh my god, what is this? And I had a feeling it was a uh, catfish because I've heard people talk about catfish. They just sit there. So I was like, I don't know if this is an eel because I've never caught an eel. And I don't know if this is a catfish because I never caught a catfish. And then I caught that catfish and I was like, oh my god, that's so cool. If it's a new fish, I don't care if it's small. I will still enjoy that catch. And after that first catch, I only want markers. Because <laughs> uh, markers bring in the money. We are still fighting this fish. It's... I hope it's bigger than the 14, 14 kg uh, Atlantic salmon that we caught. So our energy is rising. That is great. Oh, so happy. Wow, what part of the lake are we in? I've never seen this side. Oh no, it's going into the reeds. This is not good, guys. Okay, this is not good. Because uh, when it reaches the reeds, it will either decide to go to the right and then it will make a quick left turn and our boat will be going away from it. And this is the hard part right now. This is going to get tricky. So let's see my captaining skills and my fishing skills. What happens? If, uh, if this boat was a little bit faster, I don't know, maybe we could ram the fish. <laughs> Oh no. Oh no. My other line is spooling too. Crap. I really don't know how many uh, meter line that is. I don't know if that's 147 meters or 247 meters on that one. And I think the break on that thing is 25. I'm surprised even after this much time it's getting that burst of energy. Okay, it's out of the reeds. That's good. We are still... Oh no, it's turning. The it turning? Please don't turn. And it's still pushing it to orange. I think I can lock the brake. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna take that risk. Uh, that Sevan actually uh, showed me that even when you think you have it under control, it on a dime, it can just turn around and break your break your setup. I'm making a left turn here. Oh no, my other rod is ticking out too. I'm making a left turn and I'm hoping uh, that the turning radius on this stupid thing is enough. Oh, this boat was a mistake. Oh, this fish is playing ring around the rosy with us. Oh, oh, oh. 
Make up your mind. <gasps> there it is. There it is. There it is. There it is. We got it. We got it. This seems like the same size, guys. Pick the net out. 14.57. Just slightly bigger. <laughs> oh, that is amazing. Oh, I'm so happy, guys. I am streaming today because uh, this is just amazing. All right. Where are you, fishy? This is going to be a long reel in. Okay, so you weren't that big. You were just giving me a scare for no reason. Oh, we're going to have a huge payday today. Another nice sized. Wow, 3kg. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. <laughs> Uh, what an amazing time at Volkov, guys. This might be my best day ever. Holy cow, look how far we came. All the way from here. Oh my god. Oh yeah, that is some big silver. Uh, We have 93 fish. I've been here for ooh, 1 hour 46 minutes. Okay, so our rental time is almost over. Uh, But how long did we take? This guy took 12 minutes only to reel in. And I think our other one also took 12 minutes. Look at that. 14.57 kg, 13.9 kg. Oh, yes. That is some big silver. Oh, another Xander. That was amazing. Uh, too bad, not a trophy, but wow. That made my day. <laughs> uh, you want to, you guys want to see this again? Look at that. Two, 14 kg and 14.5 kg fish. And lots of markers. So that is working out for us today. Uh, do I have a fish on the other guy here? I'm not sure. Okay, let me just check the rod on the left. No? Okay, what I'm gonna do is... Oh. Wow. See, it doesn't matter where you fish. Just get fish. Oh, burbot! What? It's been so long since I've caught a burbot. I am so happy for this. Yeah, <laughs> we are dominating Volkov today, guys. This is just amazing. Uh, hello, hello. Unfortunately, I do not understand Russian, uh, but I'm glad you're here. Let's see what we can catch. I think something is on our line here. Yeah, something is on both of our lines. Holy cow. Guys, Volkov is killing it. Can't believe it. Oh my god, Xander 2.5 kg. Holy cow. I really don't want to leave this place now. Uh, this does not have a fish on. Okay, that's fine. Oh no, we are almost full, guys. Our net is full. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to start throwing out fish that are absolutely worthless. Because uh, we are so close to our time. And we have something else over here. Oh no. Another Xander. 2.6 kg. Oh, I told you guys, all the Xanders are on this side. Okay, uh, let me... So, we have... We have 10 minutes left. Uh, let me quickly... Oh, no, I really like this river muscle. Okay. Let's get rid of... No, I cannot select multiple. Okay, I think that's enough. Uh, we have space for a few more fish here. Ooh, someone caught an eel. 
Anyone understand Russian? <laughs> I'd like to know what he's saying. This person is saying another 2.5 kg Zand. Oh my god. This ending to our stream here is insane. <laughs> Wow, look at this, Xander, 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 oh, sweet, this is oh, amazing, okay, uh, oh man, I really hope you guys enjoyed this stream. Yes, I had to throw out a few fish. Actually, I had to throw out our river mussel, unfortunately. Uh, and I got a burbot. See this? Burbot. <laughs> so many Xanders. Look, three Xanders too. Oh, we have another one on this guy here. Oh, what an amazing time here. Another marker Xander, 2kg Xander, holy cow. Just killing it with this bite rate. <laughs> Clem. Oh my god, yes. Yes. Chub, okay, okay, I will take that. Man, this bite rate in the morning is insane. Uh, what's the weather like? Oh yeah, it's rain coming up. That might reduce the fishing. Oh, another fish on. Okay, I'm gonna rack up as many fish as I can in the last few minutes of our rental here. Uh, oh, Not a marker. But we have something on this guy here. Uh, another non-marker. Yeah. It's too bad. Some fish need to be really big to be a marker. Oh no, I'm at 99 fish now. Uh, keep net. Wait. Uh, discard. These are worthless fish anyway, so I don't mind. Okay. Uh, how many minutes do I have left? We have eight minutes left. Uh, sorry, no tail, no scales. I'm so sorry. I still don't understand. <laughs> uh, uh, but I appreciate uh, you sticking by and uh, watching the stream. Uh, in a few minutes, we are, I'm going to go ahead and sell my fish and we will see how much I made in two hours time. Uh, it has been, I think, the most amazing day of fishing at Volkov. Uh, so. Oh, thank you all for sticking by. It started out slow. Uh, Kura, oh my god, we are at 830,000 XP. So today I made... 130,000 XP guys in two hours here, uh, which is I guess fine Okay, I just started on Volk and my reels are screaming already. Oh, yes, top -wiz. Yes, that's what I like to hear uh, It is raining though, so it's gonna be super annoying. Oh, no You're in luck. The rain is gonna stop soon It's just warm though, so I don't know if that's gonna affect the bite rate. That's good. Volkov is really giving back. I don't know. Maybe I maybe I'll stream here again tomorrow. <laughs> if it's this good. Uh, just coming back to this island here in between was amazing. I we got uh, we got how many? Uh, one, two, three, four marker Xanders in ev once a minute in quick succession succession. Uh, so that was pretty cool. Okay. That's great. 
And I think the fish are all of a sudden quiet. Yeah, I think that's it. It just got so active and all of a sudden... Oh, oh no, 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 not right before, not, not, not right before my, my rental ends. I don't want a big fight now. Actually, if it's a huge fight, I will spend that ticket. Uh, because I'll make far more money uh, than a one hour full rental. I'd, yes. Oh, where's Atlantic Salmon? Nice. Uh, what do I need? I need tea here. Uh, beast Uh, okay, let me. And to answer you just yet, I need to catch a few more fish. And I need another tea here. A walk in between two islands and that side uh, b uh, facing the what is it boat or docks uh, a deep oh we have fish on don't we yeah we have fish on we have five minutes left in our rental guys Uh, pike. Uh, you also caught a burbet, eh? Yeah, people catch une unexpected fish so often. Uh, yeah. So the burbet, someone just caught an eel while I was streaming. I just saw someone in chat. They got an eel on uh these DP cranks. Uh, DP crank 6002 here. Into uh, Let's see. If oh no. Oh no, our, our boat is gonna expire soon. If this is a big fish, I am going to extend it. I don't think this is a big fish. Oh no, you don't. Oh, it's a 4.4. Wow. My god, even in this rain, we're getting fish. I think I should uh, turn. Oh, what an amazing day. I woke up. Nine min oh no, we have nine seconds left. Eight. Alright, that's gonna be it. I'm not even gonna bother picking up these rods because uh, I'm just gonna log out after this. Okay. I think we made an absolute killing today. Alrighty. So uh, thank you so much uh, for sticking around today. Let's go to the cafe first. Uh, where is this cafe? It's right here. Okay, is there... Ooh, Xander, 5kg. No, we don't have that. Burb, do we have... Oh my god, yes, we have a burb. Oh my god, that's 20 sil. <gasps> the river of muscle, no way. I think we had it under. Oh, so, uh... Uh, Clem, I'd love to, but I've been fishing for like, what, three and a half hours now? I need a break. <laughs> it's too much. Uh, so Burba was just a free meal for us. 20 silver right there. Uh, Xander, we don't have anything that big. Okay, that's about it for this. Let's go back here. 
and see how much we made today. Oh, nope, whoops, no, oh, <laughs> we fell right in. Oh, I'm so happy it wasn't when we were fishing. Oh, look at these pikes, they are fat pikes. Okay, uh, let's check my price here. Holy cow, 76 silver each? Holy cow, guys, we are gonna break all records. <gasps> 730 silver in two hours. Uh, that is over 350 silver per hour. Uh, 336, 7, 350, 360. Uh, yeah, so that was 20 silver, so that's 733 silver, guys. This is just amazing. Holy cow. Uh, who is messaging me? Uh, area, but now I'm not working as well. I haven't been. Uh, let me just answer him. Rank a six zero zero two. Uh, I have guys two on both right now. Yeah. All right, guys. Thank you, yeah. Uh, wow, that's amazing silver. This is the second highest hull I've ever brought in uh, in this game. The highest has been 800 and something silver at Kurai. And that day on Kurai, I got a 14 kg uh, Kurai char, 8 kg Kurai char, 6 kg Kurai char, multiple 4 and 3 kg Kurai chars. That was the day I got over 800. So this was an amazing day. We got two huge battles. I'm so happy it was all on stream and it was just an amazing day. Uh, I'm really happy for uh, everyone sticking around and watching this stream. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. I really hope I was entertaining today. And I'm just happy the fishies uh, were biting at Volkov because uh, Kurai was a letdown once more. Uh, original hooks you say I have a half to to change the hooks. We'll try. Yeah, I mean, you can put size 1 and you can leave the original, but as you saw on size 2, we got 15 kg uh, uh, salmon, so. Alright, Clem, Jessica, Totwis, everyone else, uh, thank you so much, and I will see you hopefully tomorrow maybe, I'm not sure. Uh, until then guys, uh, enjoy.